Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, submit to him and he will make your path straight. Proverbs 3, 5 to 6. Hello guys, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you doing? How have you been? If you are new to this channel, hi, my name is Miriam Tambo. I do inspirational videos, motivational videos, challenges and vlogs. So please subscribe to my channel. And if you've been here before, welcome back. Thank you so much for clicking in today's video. So guys, um, today's video, I'm going to be answering the most asked question. Like, everybody's asking me, this, okay, not everybody, but majority of the people are asking me this question. But before we start, but before we get into the video, how are you guys doing? How have you been? What's going on? I've got a question to ask. Remember those, uh, those motivational, what do you call that? Like, remember those New Year's resolution, uh, resolutions you had, like, towards the moment we started 2019? I'm pretty sure one of us had a notebook or something where we actually wrote down some points on what we want to achieve in the new year. How is it going? Are you achieving those points? Please let me know below in the comment section because it's really hard. It's really, really hard for me. But yeah, I want to know if I'm the only person who is experiencing this or not. So today's video, I'm going to be, it's like a chit chat. We're going to be chatting whilst I play my favorite uh, throwback Zambian songs. Sorry, I'm trying to put this so bad. Yeah, so today's video, we're going to be chit chatting. We're going to be talking. I'm going to be answering some of your questions. And also, if you've got any questions you'd like me to answer, please comment in the comment section. Leave your questions below. I'll be able to look I'll be able to answer them in my next video. So let us start with the song. I hope I'll not be copyrighted. <laughs> Since yeah, let's have the song. I hope you guys can hear it. Yeah, so <laughs> yeah, I'm playing my Zambia music, my playlist. Like, old is God, guys. Like, are you that kind of person who, if a new song is out, you forget the old songs? But for me, old is gold. Okay. The question is, since you guys know that. So the first question is, I don't know if you guys know, but if you don't know, listen, my name is Miriam, I'm from Zambia, and I'm in India for, yeah, I'm in India, yeah, basically, I've been in India for a long time, it's actually my fourth year, so you can say I've been here for a while now, yeah, so the, the, the question asked, like, the most asked question is, why did you come to India? Don't you have schools in Zambia? Like, we have schools in Zambia, guys. Like, we have universities, we have good schools, we have colleges, we have institutions. But why India? So let me clear all your doubts today. The reason I came to India because this question, like, everywhere I go, like, most of the people in my apartments, in my campus, in my classes, ask me, okay, but where did you come from, Africa? What's happening in Africa? Whatever. And also this video, I just want to clear the differences between uh the ones that indians have about africa and yeah like i just want to clear everything in this video I, I just want to tell you guys that don't worry i'm a youtuber i got you covered on this channel we are going to be clearing all differences that you guys have so the first question is i am zambian and why did i come to india honestly speaking when i was in high school i had no idea i was going to go abroad for school i was just one of those children who go to school um do their thing so when the time came when i finished my you guys played class two when i finished my class two my grades were out they were good and then now a time came for me to come to school because my parents never wanted me to take that gap year 
So I came into college, university right after high school. I didn't get any chance to do the all level, the A level thing that you guys do. So when I was uh, actually when I finished school, my my mom sat me down. She said, "Okay, your results are here. What are you going to do with your life? What are you going to study and all those things?" So I was like, "Okay, no problem." And then apparently the best subjects I had passed in were social sciences. You know what I'm saying, right? Yeah. So my mom said, "All right, all right, all right." So we're going to try to apply for you in so many schools. At that time, I was also trying to apply to go to University of Zambia, like one of Zambia. Zambia is actually the biggest university. It's called Unza. So I was applying to go to that school at the time. Yeah, I was applying to go to Unza, and then I also tried to go to another school called Mulungushi, one of the schools in Zambia. I don't think you guys know them, but I really applied. Not not until. After I dropped my applications, India accepted me first. But of course, lovely, yeah, lovely professional accepted me first. That's how I came to India. It's not like it was a plan from the off. Oh, let me just play a song. One more thing. I forgot that I was doing this video a chit chat with some Zambian music. Let me just play this song. Yeah. Yeah. So this is what happened. Like when. What's happening to my laptop? Alright. So, yeah, it's not like I really plan to come to India. Like, no, India is my main country. No, no, no. That's not the reason. Like, it was just one of those things. Yeah, it was just one of those things that happened. Do And then probably the next question is, do I regret coming to India? Um, I don't regret. Yeah, like, I don't regret anything I've done in my life, whether it's coming to India, whether it was a decision I made some time back. I'm just happy that it's part of the process. Coming to India was part of the process. You give the world to me. Okay. Yeah, so I don't regret coming to India. It's part of the plan. God's plan. I can wake up next to you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I can wake up next to you. before i close the video is um dear my lovely subscribers because most of my subscribers are probably from india there's no doubt about it so i just want to tell you guys something like um in africa i'll never stop saying this we do have cars okay we do have so many things it's not like just because we come to india that it means maybe we are less which one is that Maybe we are less, uh, maybe we are not able to take care of ourselves. It's, it's not like that, actually. It's, it's, it's just because, um, let me not say India, but if I say India, I think I'd be wrong. But it's, it's, it's just because of LPU. LPU is quick at recruiting people. That's why most of us came here. If you have to take a survey and ask most, uh, to ask most Zambians how they came here, probably to be one of the, it is one and the same reason. Sorry, guys, I'm trying to make a playlist here so that I should play in the next part. So, yeah, in Africa, we are okay. We are well to do, guys. And one more thing is, um, one more thing is, when you say that, when you say that Africa, Africa is like a continent, okay? Please, please, guys, when you, I'm, I'm telling you this so that you shouldn't make this mistake. Africa is a continent. So, if you see a black person, it doesn't mean we're all from the same place. Someone could be black, but I am from Zambia. He could be from Tanzania. He could be from South Africa. And then, yeah, so it doesn't mean, it's for example, Asia. You know what I'm saying? Like Asia, for example, if I'm in campus and I say an Indian, they say, hey, uh, I've seen your friend from Asia. Do you know your friend John from Japan? How are you going to know that? It's not possible. So when you see a black person, it could be that they're from the same place, 
there might be a possibility but it's not 100 percent guaranteed that that's because of how i look that all the people who look like me come from my country yes we're from the same continent which is africa but yeah i'll just break it down to say that we've got asia we've got india japan china we also have africa and other countries and south africa is not the only africa it's not the only country in africa it's just a country in it's just a country in africa we have south africa we have zambia we have zimbabwe we have lesotho we have malawi we have so many african countries so when you see us i know it's very hard for you guys to differentiate who is zambian who is zimbabwean who is south africa but it's not always that because people are from the same country are from the, have, are having the same skin probably will be from the same country that's not the that's not the case okay you guys like I don't want my subscribers making those mistakes like um yeah we know you guys from africa no 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 that's not the case yeah i hope i've answered your question guys and also one more thing yeah feel free to ask me if you're having any questions that you would love to if you're having any doubts that you would love me to if, if you're having any questions that you'd love me to answer please let me know in the comment section i'll answer them for you but in this type of video i'm just going to clarify to say i came to india mainly for school i had no plans to come here it just happened because of lpu lovely professional university and also yeah i'm from africa we have good lives we have good things everything is okay please guys have a good mindset about africans we are not bad people i'm just here to clear your doubts about everything and also before I close the video, let me just let me just play this song. Hey. <laughs> Are you even African? If you don't dance, then change your mouth. Like okay, not your mouth, but who dances and doesn't change their expressions on their faces? Too bad. Oh. I think it was done the election. All right, guys. I'm I'm trying to find one song, but I can't find the. Anyway, thank you guys for spending your time with me. If you've watched this video from the start to the end, please clap for yourself. Yeah, let me know in the comment section what you'd love to see from me. Please comment below, guys. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful give it a thumbs up subscribe subscribe to my channel and also yeah comment below guys talk to me let's connect on instagram and also please please 
follow me on instagram because on instagram it's where i post such things it's like on instagram it's where i ask you guys questions about what you'd love to see so if you're not following me on instagram please do so, so that you should not get to miss these opportunities when i ask my um followers say okay guys i'm having a poll like a poll like i'll ask two questions like which one would you prefer and people actually vote so please don't feel left out whenever there's a poll on instagram come through come through okay follow me on instagram i shall follow you back i text everyone back so just come girl just come follow your girl and also one more thing is today's notification shout out goes to daniel ngoma thank you so much for subscribing to my channel it means a lot to me and also please please keep subscribing guys don't 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 unsubscribe but subscribe let's grow this family my dream help me have my help me believe that my dreams are actually valid so if you'd love to get a shout out just subscribe to this channel and tap the bell in the next video you definitely get yourself a shout out it's been real bye